Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I'm Ray Rossini once again here from IT Nation Connect at the Shingle Creek in Orlando, Florida. And for this special edition of MSP Dispatch, I'm here with Adam Duman of Vanta. How you doing, my friend? I'm good. I feel like I've seen you a couple times this week. <laughs> a little bit. Uh, <laughs> and if you're wondering, like, who's this familiar face? Uh, he was just on Wins and Losses. Uh, that'll be coming out soon. Uh, I'm not sure when the release schedule is. Um, and constant contributor on the MMN Discord, which appreciate. Uh, but you're here for your company. You're here for security. Uh, what is Vanta exactly? Yeah, I mean, Vanta is marketing blur, right? We are the fastest path to compliance for MSPs and your customers. Provide a platform that has over 300 integrations with common partners, cloud providers, identity providers, antivirus, all kinds of stuff. And then we provide full frameworks for ISO 27001, HIPAA, GDPR, SOC 2, Type 2, trying to reduce the uncertainty, reduce all the, the brain hurt of chasing evidence and doing it all in spreadsheets, automatically pull evidence in, automatically provide you know validation that the evidence is correct, right? Are you hitting your SLAs? Trying to allow companies to focus on running their own business instead of dealing with compliance as a full-time job. Yeah. So why do I need something like that? I have SharePoint. I have Dropbox. Why do I, why do I need something like that? Have you ever been through a, a security assessment? Uh, yeah. I, I mean, I know the answer. I'm asking for our audience. Yeah. yeah. So big picture, right? I, I was a, a PCI. I am a recovering PCI QSA. You're good. And QSAs are known for being very persnickety. But what that is in reality, right? A lot of security assessments turn into an Excel spreadsheet mm -hmm. with 15 rows and 300,000 columns and blah, 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 and 500 things you have to do. And this person owns it. And that person has to upload the screenshot into SharePoint. And then showing the screw that back and forth with your auditor, yep. but inside your team, which one of these is the most up to date? What's going on? I'm super confused, right? So Vanta yep. takes all that, centralizes it, gives your auditor a portal that they can look at, gives you a place to store and track your evidence collection and management, okay. and just to keep on top of it. Continuous monitoring, ongoing, rather than once a year scramble. Yeah. You know when something's broken, you can go fix it proactively. You have your versioning, you have you can go back and this point in time, this is what happened. Yep. This is who, Test this history. Is who is, yep, okay. We know what's going on in the app. Yeah, we've seen, we have the history of our own compliance, which also helps to build trust with your customers. Got it. They know you're compliant on an ongoing basis and it keeps everybody happy. And is there a specific type of compliance that you focus on or? So IT security, we're not so much financial audit compliance stuff okay. right now. That's that's a whole different ball game. Um, and it's a space that is really... The IT security compliance area is just a nasty black hole for a lot of people anyway, Yeah, which is why I mentioned the reducing uncertainty, right? right? Focusing on what does this requirement actually mean? Go thou shalt do the thing is usually very unclear. Yeah. Here's actual evidence examples, right? These are the kinds of things that you should upload, that you should yeah. do, or that we automatically pull in to satisfy right. that. Yeah. And that goes back to those API integrations we were talking about pre-recording. Um, you have, you said 300 direct, 300 plus direct integrations. Yep. Uh, you have your APIs where you can pull data and put data in. Mm -hmm. um, the technical side of it, you know, that's one portion of it. I, I gave a rough number, 30% of compliance is technical. What about the, and you address the policy side, what about the actual, like, how do I do this? Like the advisor side of it? Yeah. So Vanta has, as an MSP, you actually get a dedicated customer success manager. I'm, it's a small team right now, but they are phenomenal. They bother me all the time for the really technical <laughs> questions. And, uh, but you know, they're around to help with figuring the platform out, answering questions about that. Hey, how do I upload a custom framework? I need to, you know, can we do this? Can we do that? And then beyond that, if you're looking for a really specific skill set, hey, I have a customer who needs a, a really good pen test, or oh, they asked for weird FINRA compliance and I don't know what that is. Yeah. One of the other things that Vanta does really well is we've got 5,000 customers and several hundred partners. So you need an expert on something? If I'm not that person and we don't have one in-house, we absolutely have another partner who can support you. And they know Vanta, they know the tool. Yeah. All right, so you have that network you can rely on. All right, so you know we're on the final day of the show. Uh, any announcements coming out or anything coming out after show? So we uh, Vanta has our, our annual security and compliance little conference that we're doing in early December. It's called VantaCon and uh, it may be available for streaming. I haven't figured that out yet, but we will yeah, be, if you need help, no. <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> we will be figuring out and uh, exactly how we want to talk about it, but we have some pretty cool stuff coming and being announced. The whole theme is the future of trust in an AI world. 
And we have, I'm cooking up some interesting stuff as part of that. Very excited to see it. Well, Adam, thank you so much, dude. I appreciate you Thank you so much. Uh, If you want to reach out to Adam or Vanta or find out what they're doing or find out about VantaCon, uh, the contact information will be in the show notes below and uh, feel free to reach out to Adam. Yeah. All right. Thank you. So until next time, ladies and gentlemen, take care of yourselves and each other. This has been a broadcast of the MSP Media Network.